Hi everyone, so today's video is going to be another Social Network Solutions hamper unboxing. This one is a summer hamper, so loads of summery items in this hamper. The dog is also having a mad five minutes, so if the dog keeps running around on the bed chasing her tail, then she's going absolutely mental. I don't know why, I don't know, she's just gone hyper all of a sudden, now she's licking my legs, so... Do you mind? Yeah, stop it. So this is the hamper as usual, it is huge and I have already opened it. It was wrapped up in cellophane and with a bow like it always is and looks really pretty and always nicely packaged. Me being me, I have to just like get straight in there. I've got, like, I've just had my dinner and I feel like I've got tomato in my teeth. Okay, now I have them but I felt like I had. So if you don't know what Social Network Solutions is, it's basically a company that gets you in touch with other brands and other companies so like bloggers can work with different brands and it's just a really good company. Every few months I seem to have got one of these hampers, I've worked with them for a long time and they're just one of my favourite companies to work with, they're so easy and yeah I always get amazing stuff from them and I always get like different brands that I've never heard of or I've never used before. I usually have like a little card in the box explaining what's in the box and the dog is nearly ruining the camera. There doesn't seem to be a card this time but that's fine. Um, I'm gonna delve in and we'll see what is in this box. I already know what's in the box because I've nosed. Um, but yeah I'll show you what's in the box. The first thing that I did notice in the box was eyelashes. Like you all know I love a good pair of eyelashes and these are from, it says I actually we love lashes on the front but they are falseeyelashes.co.uk. I've ordered from this website plenty of times and I absolutely love their eyelashes because they've got so many different brands on there and yeah it's just a good website for eyelashes. So it says Hey Olivia, finding clothes, some little gifts from us at falseeyelashes.co.uk. We hope you love them. So the eyelashes that I have got, one of them, not going to lie, I've already worn. Um, I just had to, I saw them and I was like, oh my god, I need to put them on an Instagram post. So if you don't follow my Instagram, I will leave that here and you can see what these little eyelashes look like on because I have them on on a post. Um, so these are the Coco Lashes in the style Goddess and I have seen these so many times on Instagram but I've never used them. Um, so if I just come in and show you close, I'm going to have to hold them upside down because one of them's not stuck to the board thing anymore. But how nice are these? Like, they're so full and nice and they're just me as an eyelash. I absolutely love these sort of lashes. They're so long and dramatic, which is always what I go for. So I got those ones and also some red cherry ones. And these are, I don't think it says what style they are. Ah! Style 43 Stevie. So these are like just really wispy lashes. I actually think I've used these ones before. Um, but they didn't used to do this packaging. I think the packaging of these ones is so much nicer than the roll packaging. Um, but they remind me of the Ardell Demi Wispies but longer. So yeah, I really like those ones as well for a more natural. Next up I have items from the company called Fig Leaves. And this is basically a swimwear company that also sells like lingerie and nightwear as well. Um, but yeah, they have loads of swimwear, loads of different brands on there. But I got to pick out a few different items and I just absolutely love everything that I've got. So the first thing I have is this little bralette. The dog is honestly getting on my nerves today. Look at this face. Look how annoying you are. Why are you so annoying? <laughs> Stop! Oh, really, she's climbing like all over the items I'm trying to show. Look at this face. Give up! So as I was trying to say, this is from Fig Leaves and it is the brand Fig Leaves as well. And I think with some nipple covers under this, this is just going to look so cute. I absolutely love the style of it where it's sort of like low but it's low at the back as well. I just think this will look really nice under like maybe like a checked shirt or something like that. And this is in a size small. I also got this cosy from Fig Leaves. It needs doing up at the back. And I got this in a size 30D which it's so hard to find a 30 back let me tell you every shop that you need a bra or a costume you know or something they just don't do a 30 back anywhere so i'm really pleased to get this cosy so it's this multicolored one and i colors on this are just absolutely beautiful it's got like a sweetheart neckline and it's got loads of padding and underwire in the costume as well so no worries about nipples showing or anything like that and you can also take the straps off as well so you don't have to have straps on it, it can be like a bandeau 
um, cosy. And then at the back it has like a clasp that does and it has a little backlessy bit. So I absolutely love the colours of that. It's so summery and look perfect on a beach. She's now trying to chew a coat hanger, which honestly she's doing my head in today. <laughs> this one I have, I think this one is actually my favourite and it's this black and white cosy. Um, so again, just your basic cosy at the bottom and it's a halter neck one. But just look at the colours. I just I know the black and white, but I just love how they're different on each side and then this one is backless as well. I absolutely love this. I feel like if I was going to like a spa or something, which I'm not going to a spa, um, it just looked really nice. But I also think as well, because it's like this, you can get away as wearing as a bodysuit with a pair of jeans. So yeah, I absolutely love this one. This has to be my favourite. I also have this one, which is very risky. Let me tell you, I think I need some boob tape with this one because I have tried it on. Um, this is from the brand Blue Bella, which I've never heard of before. I've seen quite a lot of these sort of style costumes before. Again, again I thought this would look really nice as a bodysuit. So again, it's halter neck and it has these gorgeous like crochet sort of details on the front of the boob bits. And then it is literally like completely backless. So this one would look so nice with a pair of jeans. But then again, if you're going to like a beef or you know Marbella, somewhere like that where you've got to wear like a really out there cosy. I think this would look perfect with like a really long kimono and wedges over the top so I absolutely love that one as well. I got this one in a size, it's in a size 8 and the black and white one is in, didn't even mention that one did I? That one is in a size 8 as well and that one is um, a Fig Leaves brand. I then have this beautiful Ted Baker cosy like look at the print on this. It is so nice. Have you noticed how I've gone for cosies and not bikinis I just feel like cosies are more versatile um, but this again can be a bandeau bikini but it does also have like a halter neck strap on it I've tried it on and personally I like it stop puppy I personally like it with the strap around so this is what the back looks like and it's just sort of got the same print so it goes really great at the bottom and then it's floral everywhere else this is in the size where is the size on this one so this one's in a 32C, like I just go from size to size with bras and just hope that they fit. But the the 30D and the 32C, they both fit lovely so, you know, you can always tighten the straps as well if needed. But I just love this bit. It just reminds me of a mermaid like with a shell bikini on it, it's just so cute isn't it. Next up I've got a little hair mask kit and this is from the brand Cook on Eve. I have heard so much about this and seen loads of like sponsorships on Instagram and people doing the hair on Instagram. Um, so this is the Cocoa Eve Like a Virgin Super Nourishing Coconut and Fig Hair Mask. Bonus Tangle Tamer Brush with Two Tiered Bristle Technology. Look how cute the packaging is as well, it's so summery. But yeah, I absolutely love anything sort of hair related that's going to make your hair feel better because obviously I dye my hair so I'm all about that. Although I don't dye it often, I probably dye it once a year. Like, I'm so lazy, I get my roots done like once a year. I've had them done as you can probably tell, but um, yeah, so inside it says wear coconuts about hair and then you open it up and this is what it looks like. So you've got your little brush in there and the hair mask as well. So the brush says Coco and Eve and it looks like, you know, your basic sort of tangle teaser. It feels really nice as well, it feels really velvety. And then the actual hair mask itself which pulls out. I have been dying to use this. I'm going to wash my hair tonight just so I can use this hair mask. So I'm going to unscrew this and it's got a little plastic lid on the top. I've just stuck my finger in it. And it does smell very coconut -y. I need to get this dangly bit off my finger now. <laughs> also this product is 100% vegan and they do not test on animals and it's sulfate and paraben free as well which you know it's always a plus in my eyes. It says it's infused with coconut extract, essence of fig and shea butter to create a luscious and rich mask. Restore your hair to its pure virgin state, deeply conditions, improves shine and hydrates the hair from root to tip for super amazing hair like a virgin again. Let me know if you've tried this and let me know what you think of it because I have seen so much about it and I just really hope it lives up to how it looks on the sponsorship so I'm dying to give it a go. But I have a little box here and in here we have another secret scent box. You may have seen a while ago I did a video all about the secret, the secret scent boxes and I've also had another one in my 
social network solutions hamper before basically they're like a subscription box which you get through your door and it's got samples of perfume in so you get to try different samples sort of every time you get your new box so this one says june edition and in this one we have i've just put all the cards over there vera wang princess which has like always been one of my favourite perfumes when I was younger and I haven't smelled it for ages so I'm gonna it's gonna be one of them smells you know where you smell it and it like just brings loads of memories back. Um Jean-Paul Gaultier classic au fresh I don't think I'm saying that right but and Gucci Flora Glorious Mandarin. See I've never tried the other two before so it's a really good way to sort of get to know a perfume. So you've got your little samples here pop them in your handbag for a night out and then if you think oh my god I absolutely love that perfume you can then go buy it so they are a really cute idea of these and I do think they're good I'm gonna have to, have to spray the Vera Wang because I just need to I need to get some memories oh, it just smells like me when I was a teenager that's so weird it's so weird when you get the smell and all the memories just come smelling back I have a little box from Eden Perfumes and the website is edenperfumes.co.uk it says we match your favourite perfume handmade paraben free and falsates free don't think I'm pronouncing that right this is 10 ml oh that Vera Wang smells amazing I'm not going to be able to smell this now am I so this is Eden Perfumes 309 so let's have a sniff of this one that was really nice do you know what, that's really strong as well. I feel like that's going to be one of them perfumes that lasts all day. I'm going to keep that in my work bag, because especially at the minute with it being hot and I'm spraying every two minutes because I'm sweating and I'm like, oh my God, I stink. So I'm going to keep this in my work bag. It smells even better once it's dried down as well. It's like a quite a strong smell. I really like that. That's going in the work bag. Two little items from Beauty Blender. So I have the Blender Cleanser, the solid, like, Beauty Blender thing <laughs> it's to clean your ba makeup brushes basically i think this one's like it says it's the ultimate makeup sponge and brush cleaner i think this one's like a soap sort of thing so you can swirl it into it and then get your products out of your brush and then i also have the liquid version which i have used before and use it for my um makeup brushes but this one is really for your makeup sponges see i don't really use beauty blenders so I'm much more of a brush person, but apparently this one's really good for beauty blenders and that one's for brushes. Last but not least, I have a few items from Organic Shop. So, first thing I've got here is another hair mask. And this is Lavish Avocado and Honey Hair Mask. 98% natural, so no parabens again or silicones. It's just the same as the other one, so let's have a smell. That smells amazing. A lot of people don't like avocados, but I quite like them, but the texture's a little bit weird. I'm not like, I'm not like the biggest fan of avocados, like some people absolutely love them. Anyway, that's completely off, off the subject. Um, so yeah, a natural hair mask, and it says on here, free from SLS, L uh, S L E S, <laughs> parabens and silicones, made from organic avocado and organic honey, 98% natural, repairs and nourishes hair in just two minutes. So another hair mask where I'm going to be just washing. I'm just going to be washing my hair all the time out just to try out these new hair masks. Then we also have push-up buttocks. And uh, this couldn't have come at a better time because it's summer. I've got to wear shorts and there is nothing I hate more than the backs of my legs. I despise them. Like, I, if you watch my videos for a long time, you'll have known how skinny I used to be. So I'd never sort of want to get back to that weight because for me, I just, I didn't look good. But there was like an in-between stage of now and when I was really skinny. And for me, that was like my perfect weight, my perfect body. And now I've gone past that and I just eat shit all the time. And yeah, I've developed cellulite. So I never had cellulite when I was skinny. And I know I'm not, when I say I'm, I was skinny, I know I'm still little. Um... But yeah, I never used to have cellulite, and I know it's, you know, 100% of women get cellulite. Skinny women get it, and yeah, it's it's just a thing, isn't it? It's just, it's just that, yeah, it's just part of being a woman. It's just another one of the cons of being a woman. Um, so anyway, I got this push-up buttocks sculpting gel, shape, smooths and firms. So it says it refines the buttocks, reduces the appearance of stretch marks and firms the buttocks. 
99.6% natural and it's cruelty free and hypoallergenic so I'll definitely be giving this a go I don't have tons of stretch marks I have a few on my bum but the more I feel like it's more cellulite on my bum than anything else but I'm definitely gonna see what it's like it smells good as well so yeah I'm just rubbish at putting creams on my body I need to get into the habit of doing it all the time because I'll do it once and I'm like oh, I just can't be bothered but I want to get into using this so I'm definitely gonna try that and then the last thing we have is Natra Siberica Northern Soap so this is a formulated formulated using Siberian herbs and flowers harvested with the help of Siberian tribes purifies and detoxifies skin using activated charcoal for deep facial cleansing to be used once or twice a week cruelty free and it helps to regulate sebum and fight impurities without drying the skin so this is what it looks like it's in this huge box and I obviously haven't opened it so let's have a delve in because I feel like charcoal, activated charcoal stuff is like everywhere at the minute or is that just me? It's like in toothpaste, in cleansers, like it just seems to be in everything so anything that can help me with impurities and oil on my skin is a bonus for me because my chin drives me insane. I get so many like impurities on it and because I do get a lot of oil there that's why I get all the impurities. So. This is what it looks like. It's in quite a big tub. I didn't expect it to look like that. It's literally like a solid cleanser. Obviously it's black because of the charcoal. Oh, it smells really strong. It smells very soapy. I like the smell actually, but do you know what? If this is going to help. And you also get a little sponge of it as well. So you wet the sponge with the water, apply the soap on the sponge and then apply the soap onto the face using the sponge so you literally put the cleanser on the sponge and do it on your face so you use this once or twice a week I can do that I'm all about do you know what I'm absolutely rubbish with my whole body skin but my face skin I, I look after like there's no tomorrow I, I just use everything on my face skin so yeah I'll definitely see what that's like and hopefully it works because I find nothing works with my chin it's so oily and nothing ever works. So that is everything in this month's hamper. Thank you as always Social Network Solutions for picking to work with me. I absolutely love the hampers and everything that I receive every single time. This, this time round, this hamper, there's literally nothing that I don't like. Everything in this hamper will get used. So thank you so much for working with me and thank you so much to all the brands that I have put into this hamper as well. Please remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and please give it a thumbs up. And thank you for watching everyone. I will see you all in my next video. Bye!